Welcome to Resman Help. This session covers stage one of PPMs in Resman, dealing with the control file and the related code files, and they're found in the administration section. This flowchart shows the process of creating our PPM planning year and week numbers, threshold figures for demand and capacity planning, and a year end routine to create the new PPM planning year and week numbers. The control file opens in the work processing tab and this is where your PPM planning year start and end dates are located. Whilst you could set up a PPM planning year between any range of dates, the system's been designed to conform to an ISO compliant PPM year and Resman support staff can give you further details on this if required. A brief description of the ISO compliant PPM year is in this yellow text box. The Resman PPM planning year contains all PPMs due in a user definable 12 month period and work is stored by week numbers which are automatically calculated. We set the start and end dates each year and these dates are initially set up for you by Resman support staff and they're located here. And over here we have an option in the actions area advanced PPM year which is used at year end to automatically calculate our new PPM planning year and week numbers. I'm now going to highlight this uh, traffic light colour coding and this is where we set up our target planning thresholds as a number of jobs and hours which is used optionally for demand and capacity planning. As our PPMs go into the annual plan we can easily smooth the plan to suit our resources. The code file area is where we set up and maintain all our supporting code files for asset management, work processing, staff details, names and addresses for contractors as we can issue PPM to contractors as well as our in-house colleagues. If you utilize the stock control module you can also link stock parts required for PPMs. And finally we also suggest that you view the help video on document management as this offers many benefits in running your PPMs where you can print associated work checklists, safety notices and as for example with fire door checks a list of doors to be inspected. This completes PPM stage 1 of setting up the control file and the supporting code files.